So, we are at the largest independent bookstore in the world. That's kind of crazy. They have about more than 1.5 million books here. What is it called? Powell's. I'm gonna go check like religion books. I wanna see what they have. Okay, so I think I found this section um, and it's huge. It's huge. I mean, look at, look at all these books. So I think I'm going to um, do a quick little montage of some of my favorite books, my favorite authors. So yeah, check it out. on a quest to find Adventist things. Let's do this and then we'll go. Adventist, Adventist stuff. Oh. We're close. It says other. Oh, what is this? Oh, Luther? Oh. What? The Seventh day Adventism. Okay, that's cool. What is in there? What is really in there? Like five oh, there we found it. Ellen G. White. Excellent. She made it. We made it. We made it. We made it. We made it, we made it man. We Auntie Egg White. Let's go. So, so for those of you who don't know Ellen White, she is. I think she's like the most. I think she's the most translated female author of all time. I think. Oh, I think that's true. If you're if you're Adventist, you're watching this, verify that, please. I don't know. Add a comment below. Just let me know if I'm like absolutely right or like dead wrong. And also. Comment if you felt offended that he called her Auntie Egg White. That's true. That's true. She's like, she's like a big deal in our denomination, you know. Got the eighteen eighty eight stuff. Okay, if you don't know about that, stuff went down. Stuff went down in eighteen eighty eight in our denomination. Uh, what else? Seventh Day Adventists believe classic for sure. That's it. That's all we got, but it's okay. It's all right. It's all right. Start you gotta, you gotta start somewhere, right? Okay. I think uh, we found uh, stuff. So let's just uh, go. <laughs> Okay, so for anybody, this is not a religious book, but for anybody who wants to get into a really nice, like, audio book, um, almost like with a movie feel, this is it right here. Educated. Tara Westover. It is so good. It's just a great memoir that talks about the intersections between religion and culture and politics and just real life stuff. It's just amazing, amazing, amazing stuff. Also, you know, please let me know if there's any books that you want me to read or recommendations of any books because I'm totally for that stuff. So anything that has uh, influenced you, love to love to hear about that. Love to hear about that. This is Kevin at Cross Culture Christian, helping you bridge the gap between your life and the good life. Take care and God bless. You.